He has asked the question that when he has been to many mosques throughout the world, most of the places, the prayer area for men and women, it is separate. But when he went to Hajj and when he went to Makkah and Mina, Muzdalifa, the prayer area is the same and men and women are mixed and separate. What does the face to realize that everywhere, even in Makkah and in Muzdalifa and Mina, the prayer area is same. But because of the situation, for example, when we go to Makkah, and there one of the important pillars is you do tawaf. Now when you do tawaf, you can't have separate area for tawaf. That's the reason while doing tawaf, there's bound to be, we can't have separate spaces. But after they finish tawaf, normally men and women have got different designated areas, even in Makkah. But while they are doing tawaf, if the salah time takes place, some women may not reach the designated place, so there are occasions when they stand in areas which is not designated for the women. So because of this, there are occasions when we find, when we see, there may be some women mixed up in the gent area, but ideally, you see, when you come at the rear side, not at the tawaf, not at the mutaf, at the other part, you find that there is separate designated area for the women and separate for the men. In normal mosques that we have, the entry gates of men and women is separate. In haram, there are separate areas even for women to enter. But because when they go for tawaf, there is bound to be that they mix. But when they pray, they are supposed to be at different areas. But because the time may not permit them to reach the area, there are occasions when you may find that there may be certain mixing on certain positions. Same thing in Mina. Same thing in Muzdalifa. Even in Muzdalifa and Mina, you will never find men and women standing in the same room. Because they are scattered, it's a very big area. We, because they come with their families, same when they come for the Haram, in Makkah they come with their family. So here, because they come with family, to have separate segregation, half, suppose it's maybe 100 acres, so half for gents, half for ladies, then the family cannot stay together. In all the other mosques, because the mosque is small, you can easily have separate area for Salah, separate for entry, separate for exit, and they can meet their family outside. Here, because Muzdalifa, Arafat is hundreds of acres, and the family come together to do Hajj, while they stay in Arafat, Mina, Muzdalifa. So at that time, even when they pray, men and women don't stand in the same row. There is a separate area, but the areas are scattered. Because of that, it may not look that they are separate. But if you go to Masjid al-Khaif, that is in Mina, or in Arafat, Masjid al-Namra, there, there is separate segregation, just like any other mosque. Because when they pray in a large gathering, in a large area, it is difficult when families come together. Otherwise, always men and women, they are supposed to be separate. Why? Separate, but equal facility. The reason is, so that they can concentrate on Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala better and there's no intermingling of sexes. Hope that answers the question, brother.